today's vlog. Once again, I'm going to the wash house to do some laundry. I need to go to Walmart and pick up a few things. And I'm also making Juliet's Halloween costume this year. So I need to go to Hobby Lobby and get a few materials for that. Juliet, are you happy? Happy? Happy. <laughs> I feel like I just got out of the laundry mat Olympic. I'm literally sweating. The laundry mat? <laughs> there was underwear flying everywhere. I was like running to try and grab a dryer. It was, oh. Oh no. It was rough, but we made it out. And now we are headed to Hobby Lobby yeah. so I can, yeah, did you get some stuff at Walmart? Oh, hi. Are headed to Hobby Lobby now so I can finish getting things to make Juliet's costume but I want to know are you guys making your kids costume this year or what are they going to be for Halloween are you dressing up as a family what's it gonna be Juliet is gonna be a little red riding hood and I was gonna be the old grandma and Dakota was gonna be the big bad wolf but we don't really have anywhere to go so we'll see but she's still gonna be a little red riding hood but yeah leave a comment down below what is your kiddo or you or your family going to be for Halloween? Birds are like, they're just everywhere. The birdie. She just gets so much attention everywhere she goes. I know. It's like people just love her. Every like, if I had a penny for every time somebody said, where'd you get that red hair from? Oh, pretty yeah. cute. How are you? Say hi. Hi. I love you. Cheese. Hot fit in the camper. Life was dull until you came. I was breathless when we first met. Couldn't keep my hands away. I was speechless when we first met. Yeah, you took the pain away. Didn't mind my scars, mend my broken heart. So we just had dinner and tomorrow I am wanting to make my stew so I think I'm gonna go ahead and marinate my meat and everything um, overnight so that it's ready to go in the morning because right now it's frozen um, I'm just using round steak for my beef stew you're supposed to use chuck roast but I don't have chuck roast and I have round steak so I'm just trying to use what I have figure out how to fit it in there Dakota went outside to play washers with the neighbors, so we're gonna clean up and head that way. Going to 
church. Hit that like and subscribe button. After church, we're going to make our stew and watch the football game. So, yeah. Alright guys, so we are back home and I'm going to share my recipe now. I have my meat marinating and I think I am going to get started on that. Okay, so I have my meat in. I'm just going to brown it a little bit on each side and then I'm going to add my ingredients. While that's browning, I'm going to chop up my onion. I'm going to add my onion, tomatoes, some tomato paste, garlic, and my meat broth. about a third of a cup of beef broth to add with flour later in case I want to thicken up my stew. Now I'm going to chop and prepare the rest of my vegetables. I'm going to let this cook for two hours first before adding anything else because I don't want the rest of my ingredients to get mushy and basically disintegrate by the time the meat is finished cooking. almost finished. I'm going to whisk together some beef broth and flour. You don't have to do it overheat, but Dakota went ahead and put some butter and just made a roux. Um, and then go ahead and stir that in and it will make your stew thicken up perfectly. And it's looking great. The stew smells so good. Oh my goodness. Yeah. Alright guys, that is all for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please give this video a thumbs up and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye! Say bye! Say bye bye! Oh.